given the political divide that you see here in Washington now in your role as senator, do you feel that folks are just uninspired to come out to vote no matter who the candidate is? You know, no, actually I don't. I mean, I've been seeing a level of activism and participation that actually gives me a lot of optimism about um, our future. I've been seeing young people, um, teenagers, even middle school students who are coming out, who are thinking about issues, who are speaking issues. You know, you look at anything from those kids from Parkland, the Florida high school students, and, and what that has excited around high school students around the country to speak up about issues like gun violence. You look at the Dreamers and the DACA kids who are coming by the thousands to the United States Capitol to walk the halls of Congress to speak about immigration policy. Um, you look at all of the young um, people in particular of color who are coming out to talk about issues that relate to disparities around race or economic disparities and inequalities. I actually am very excited about what I've been seeing. I've been seeing a record number of women who are running for office, many of whom have never run for office before. So I think there is something about this very difficult moment in time, which is where we are right now, where we have you know, powerful voices that are sowing hate and division. The, the other side of that is that it's activating a lot of people to say, I'm not going to stand for it, I'm going to get out, I'm going to stand up, I'm going to stand out, I'm going to speak out. So I think it's very exciting, and the, the only thing that I would ask everyone and all of your viewers is stay involved. Stay involved, because your issues will not be heard if you don't stay involved, if you don't speak out, speak through your vote, speak through your voice, get, stay, get involved in elections, campaigns, look up candidates, who, whoever speaks to your values and your issues, but stay involved. That's how democracy works, and, and we won't be seen if we're not heard.